Well, we decided to do it down allotment. It's Saturday morning. Just about, just about. And we thought, well, let's go and have a look. We've had a bit more rain again. But look at this. We should be very careful where I'm standing. As you can see, it's still swamped. But, as you can see, it's ice. All behind the next door to us. It's like an ice rink. I need to do something with this compost bay. Um, but as you can see, I can't really walk anywhere because that whole slot is full of water. We did come down to put some cardboard on the beds, to be honest, but you will see in a minute. I'm very, very cautious, at least walking, even on the path, it's a bit slippy, but inside this broken greenhouse where the actual grape tree is, it's swamped. It's really, I can't get on here, it's just, look, water. That tree. Not been able to do anything with it, and it's also piled up over there. But you can't work with conditions like this. Um, that's all collapsed. It's not a big deal, it's unstructural. But this is the path that's going on to the allotment. But it's not too bad this bit, but when I get to here, I'm stopping now. It's just swimming but yeah when I move these beds you can't really see because the shadows you can actually see the even water in there looks like we've got some volunteer garlic last year it rotted off I was wondering this hasn't rotted to be honest but oh that's full it's you see all me flowers whatever they were they're all starting to come up that's all trees that's starting to look nice Starting to get blossom on them, but I can't get down to actually cut anything. Um, but we can see them rhubarb. <laughs> I can't even get to anything. It's just look inside there. It's water. It's an absolute swamp around here, and I really, really don't know where this is going to actually clear off. Got lots to do. Can't do anything about it. You cannot work in these conditions. One, you can just damage the soil. And two, you're just walking in water. Well, hey ho. This has to be a catch up game once we um, once we get something decent. I think you might be able to hear the robin chirping away because he spotted us. But it's nice and sunny. As you can probably see with the skies behind me, but it's only three degrees. Anyway, speak to you all later. Bye-bye now.